today I'm going to be teaching you how to use the dot robot. If you watch our previous video, you will know that I am already connected on my iPad to the dot robot and we are going to try and work with our dots today. So as you can see on the app that we have called Wonder, that controls our dot robot. So I'm going to start with what's called the scroll quests, which is right over here. That's gonna help your students get a better understanding on how these robots work. So I'm gonna click on scroll quest. And as you can see, we're at the beginning. It's called the Wonder Workshop. It goes through a whole bunch of different things for your students to be able to figure out how to work this robot. So let's start at the beginning called Hi Robot. It's going to tell us how to use this robot if we follow along. So we can make dot say hi. If I connect and I hit play. So as you play, as you can play with this scroll quest, it will teach your students how to do different activities with that robot. So let's continue, let's try one more. The next one is called Loopy Lights. Let's try that one. Ooh, so Dot likes to dress to impress. Let's put his blinking lights in a loop. So, we're gonna make him automatically turn on blue lights to go to here, and then automatically turn on red lights. Let's try it. So you can see in our, in our robot as we're practicing, these things will show on the robot how to work those things. So now it's gonna teach us how to work in a continuous loop that we then take this back and go back to blue and then blue back to the beginning and it will be a continuous loop. Nice job. So as you can see, our robot's eyes were changing color based off of our coatings. So besides the Wonder Workshop, if you go back to the beginning, beginner's log, you can look at the inventor's log, which is what students might have done before, and also the controller. So as you can see, here are all the options for our dot. You can make him say things off to the side, like the top, the top left one is high. So if I click it, our robot will communicate like that. If I want him to say bye, I can also do that. Okay, see ya. And there are other cues and things that he can say over off to the side. And there are animal noises that he can make. So if I want him to sound like a chicken, I can just click that button. Also, if you would like his eye color to change, you can drag this color. You can also have him do different things with his eyes. And if you would like for him to talk, you can speak into the recording button. So I can select a slot that I would like to record. I'll go all the way to number 10. And I can record my voice. Hello everybody, how are you doing today? Sounds good to me, so I'm just gonna go ahead and click that green check mark gonna load and transfer to our dot robot and then when I click on number 10 dot then speaks as what I recorded so I can just hit 10 and now dot can communicate with us again the most important one for the students as they're starting starting out would probably be to be completing this scroll quest that's gonna help them understand all the different activities along with dot well I hope that you enjoyed learning today. I hope that you liked learning about Dot and I'll see you later.